Right, so I have some really cool artifacts that I've found, one of them relating to Jesus, and I've read that one, so I've read the details on that one so far. So let me show you a little bit more. Right, so if I go here, and then I go into my inventory, and from my inventory, if I go to my bag, and then I go down, there are these collectibles. Now I have three at the moment. You can see that this one here, I cannot pronounce it, but maybe we'll get some backstory and one of them might pronounce it in the game. You can see it on screen, thankfully. A rich, a richly automated box made from silver, gold and enamel. It was made in the Byzantine Empire, displays the crucifixion and allegedly contains a piece of the true cross. Right, so I'm about to give Dervis this and see what he says. There is also another, if we move over, you've got Buddhist votive plaque. An ornamental plaque used in ceremonies to offer prayers or express gratitude. This one was made during the Chinese Tang Dynasty and features numerous Buddhas. These tablets were brought to sacred caves and shrines as an act of merit and left at the location. And we have the Aksumite Amulet, a small pouch of magic powder made from leather and worn around the neck. During ancient times, the Aksum Empire was one of the major powers together with Rome, China and Persia. According to the Persian prophet Mani, its decline started around the 7th century. So these three items here, one relating to Jesus, the other relating to Buddha, and then one relating to a fallen dynasty, Aksum. Let's return him and see what he says. Good to see you. Good to see you too. I trust you are behaving yourself out there, yes? <laughs> How nice of you. Return the artifacts, these are the three. Is he going to give us a voice note or anything? Here. Take a look. A veritable horde you've got there. Yo, that's what he said. Oh, that's mad. That's, that's mad. That's mad. Okay. 